Hello to you from one of the great footballing cities in Spain. We're at the Estadio Ciudad de Valencia. My name is Derek Ray. With me in the commentary box is Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Levante, and they take on Rayo Vallecano. Yeah, thanks, Derek. I always get a buzz from being here. The players will feel the same, I'm sure. Fast start, always a good idea to impose yourself on the game straight from the off. Con el 15, Postigo. Con el 19, Carlos Clerc. Con el 12. And now the starting 11 for Levante. A standard 4-4-2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. Here's how it looks for Rayo Vallecano. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Que volte el Estadio Ciudad de Valencia. Esto va a empezar. And this confrontation is underway. Melero. Now with Bardi. Melero. And the emphasis is on creativity. Able to get his body in the way. Well, one player who can really do damage is Morales. Lee, I wonder what you think we'll see from him in this game. Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. Well, pressing high is something the visitors like to do. It can take a lot out of any team, but it... we wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Melero. And a chance to whip it in here. Oh, nice ball over the top. The defender doing his job. Played into the centre of the box. A goal! 1-0! A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. Well, as the ball comes to him, he's not got an awful lot of time or space, but he gets the power from somewhere, and it's a brilliant finish. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. The opening goal of the game then. Garcia, Oscar Trejo, Oscar Valentin, Esteban Savelic.
Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Santi Comesanya. Oscar Trejo. It looks promising. But it can't get through. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Oscar Trejo. And providing width. Really getting stuck in defensively. Jorge Miramon. Postigo. De Frutos. Roger. And he read it well defensively. Garcia. Santi Comesanya. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. And in the perfect position to read it. Garcia. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? It might be on for them. Morales. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Santi Comesanya. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Santi Comesanya. What can he do from here? Well, that's the kind of play you want from your defender. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Well, as we can see, Real Vallecano enjoying the bulk of possession here. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. Oscar Trejo. Possession lost. Roger. Melero. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Enis Bardi, Melero, Robert. Clerk. Postigo. Morales. Committed challenge.
Also, not showing good vision. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. Y el Levante va a hacer un cambio. Sale del terreno de juego con el 22, Melén. Entrará en su lugar con el 17, Muxevich. Morales. See some progress with the ball at his feet. And Morales. He takes aim. Just couldn't get it through. And the counter attack is on. Options available. This looks promising. He made it look simple, really. Vukcevic. Rocina. Clerk. Getting the ball away. Atención. Que el dueño de una autocaravana blanca de marca alemana y matrícula impar acuda urgentemente a... Santi Comesaña. Will it be? Couldn't grab hold of it. Into the goalkeeper's grateful grasp at the second time of asking, but first time around, it was a good deal more complicated. Yeah, it was a fabulous save initially. He gets the ball in the end with great relief. Well, just listen to the atmosphere, Derek. It's been such a tight game, but can they see this out now? The fans are certainly doing their bit. Postigo, far from a good pass. Esteban Savelic. A potential danger here. It's a good looking ball in behind. This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. And there we are, Derek. You said it right at the end of the game. He's fluffed these lines, but the keeper takes great credit for that. And they're making a change. And firing it into the area. And following the clearance, it will be a corner. And now the delivery. Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and then it's a good headed finish, to be fair. Keeper, no chance. Lovely goal. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. And only two minutes remaining here. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Postigo. Roger. There we have it, the 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides.